welcome back to my channel. Let me scoot back a little bit. Um, so in this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys my 20 week ultrasound and some footage from that day because my mom was here Thursday night, Friday, and then Saturday. And she actually came to the ultrasound with me because Connor is still not here. He'll be home very, very soon, but he's not. Um, and so she was able to come with me and that was just such a blessing that my mom was able to come and be a part of that because I really didn't want to do it alone. But we spent most of the weekend just like hanging out and tidying up the house and getting so much work done. So I didn't really vlog a lot, but I did get a lot of clips from the day of the ultrasound and my mom was kind of like my camera woman. <laughs> um, she like recorded all of it. So I will show you guys some of that. On Friday, I turned 20 weeks of um, pregnancy <laughs> and I I went to my ultrasound and I had two ultrasounds that day. The first one was at 10 o'clock. I'm at my doctor's appointment with my mom. And that one was just kind of like a checkup, making sure I'm doing okay and if I have any questions or things like that. And then they also monitored the baby's heartbeat. Yeah. And then in the last month of pregnancy, at some point the baby tends to drop down into the pelvis. And so if you had been having bad heartburn or difficult to take in a deep breath, that gets a little better. But then the baby sits on your bladder. So, so then you're peeing the all the time. Tray and I, exactly. <laughs> And so that one re went really well. I had heard the baby's heartbeat before, but each time hearing the heartbeat is just so, so special. And so um, I got to hear it again and just a confirmation that my baby is doing okay. And that's always exciting. So um, that was the first appointment. And then the second appointment was the actual like hour long and people usually find out the gender and they like check the baby's heart they check the baby's brain they check all the bait all the things going on with the baby to make sure that um, it's growing healthy it's growing strong it's doing the things that it's supposed to and and at the 20 week it's they usually find out um, if there's like any um, genetic issues or things like that so that was the one that I had so today I am with my mom and we are headed to my 20 week ultrasound so this is when I get to see the baby I get to see the baby moving and I will find out the gender, but I'm not gonna find out the gender today because I'm waiting for Connor to get home in two weeks. So it's killing me because I get to find out, but I don't technically get to find out. They're gonna put it in an envelope and then I have to just keep it. Hey Britt, what are we doing? I'm gonna go see the baby at the ultrasound. 20 weeks. doing to me. <laughs> you see his little hands moving. Her. His or her little hands. And that one was really special because the last time I saw the baby was when I first found out I was pregnant. I have not seen the baby since then. I guess it was eight weeks. So it's been uh, 12 weeks since I've seen my baby and just the growth 
that has happened it's like so crazy and the baby is so big which is so amazing as i stated in the video um i will not find out the gender until connor is home in two weeks so right now i actually i think i put it up but i have a little picture and the picture is turned backwards or upside down i guess and it has the gender written on it so i have it with me and i have like been so tempted to open it because i want to know what the like gender our baby is um but i'm like no i gotta wait for connor because i want us to have that special moment together and my mom was there and she, like she didn't even want to find out she was like i will spill the beans if i find out and so whenever it came to that part where she was like looking at the parts of the baby she was like okay you have to turn away and so we turned away and um and so that was like really really hard but the 20 weeks one was awesome i do technically have the gender with me but i just don't know the gender which is the most like hard part i think so i'll be having the gender reveal in two weeks when he gets home and then i will post um that for you guys so that you can also know but so far the baby is doing awesome and um i'll show you guys my bump what my bump looks like oh if i can get up <laughs> So this is my bump right now compared to my body. I don't know if you can see that. Put, pull my shirt up a little bit. So that's what it looks like. It's getting very round. It's like popped now more so than it has been. Um, but looking like a little bump now and like i said baby is healthy and strong and has a heartbeat of 148 and also let me show you um some pictures really quickly from the ultrasound all right so this is like the typical baby shot this one is like the baby sucking his or her thumb or like putting the hand near his face or her face <laughs> And then this one is the arm like this over um, its face. If you can see that. <laughs> Some of these are kind of hard to show on camera. And then this one is a little baby foot. So the foot is right there. And then this is the butt. And then there's another foot right there. And then this one's a bigger view of the baby. So yeah, those are the pictures. This is my baby. He, she is so cute. <laughs> but I'm still like totally team girl. I totally think it's a girl. Um, and I don't know what Connor believes now since he's been gone for a while, but um, I've tried to transition him into thinking that it's a girl. But he was boy, so we'll see what he says in that video. But um, hope you guys enjoy this video. Thanks for following along on this journey. Um, I can't believe I'm 20 weeks, which is halfway already, because it just seems like it's going by so quickly. And I've been having more energy, no sickness, like I mentioned a few weeks ago. And cooking for myself more, I have started to have more um, like allergies and back pain and just small things like that, but nothing like the first trimester, which is amazing. So um, yeah, anyways, uh, thanks for following along and I will see you guys possibly at our gender reveal. Okay, bye.